Here at Kiteboarding.com, we're here to describe the new 2009 Dekine Fusion, which is one of our top selling harnesses. The reason is, is that people who are getting into the sport, this keeps the harness from riding up on you, with the kite's pulling above your head a whole lot of the time. Uh, it ha does have the straps, they're very cushioned, uh, very comfortable as straps can be. Um, it tightens up, gets a really good grip and keeps it from riding up into your shoulders and later on if you ever wanted to it's very easy to ride this harness even without putting your legs through the straps which is kind of like the Sonic model but the all-around top model that we sell as a seat harness is the Dekine Fusion has a great coverage on the back a handle for someone to grab very easy um, has a great bar stable stabilizing system because it's so spread out here as well as it has your leash hookup uh, again, to use a leash on this, you will want a releasable leash that it releases on the leash itself. Those are on the website. Uh, it has the clip-in, the kinds clip-in system. The fusion harness is, you do not have to have a bar pad with it. It's a, an addition, uh, mainly because of the system. It does stabilize the bar really well, but some people do add the bar pad to it just to keep it down if it uh, does start to pinch you as well as if you would like to install a knife onto the system, the Dekine knife, this can be slid into the bar pad inside underneath. So this can be installed, it's a really nice clean system. This is the way we, we definitely recommend using it in some cases, uh, in most cases. Some people will buy the knife which comes with this small bag but you can unthread your straps and thread this onto the side of the harness, which some people do as well. It's a nice little addition. It's uh, on there as an add-on. So what we're going to do is we're going to clip in. We'll put the clip on one side. You can put it on both and just slide the harness off. If you feel that you uh, are going to be doing some maneuvers, they may make the bar pop out under high torque loads from each side as riding blind or doing some very twisted up maneuvers. And you can do this on both sides if you wanted to and just slide it on as a, basically like a pair of shorts or something. So I'm gonna unhook it and put this on. Um, when you go to do the leg straps, uh, when you're sizing these, it's, it's mainly around the waist to put it on. You begin by putting your legs through the straps, loosen these up, they're bungee tensioned uh, under the neoprene. So you'll want to step in, make sure that these are loosened all the way, slide the harness up, and again, as you can see, some people will say the harness doesn't fit me, but these are all bungeed on both sides. The Fusion has the power belt on both sides begin by pulling it out, loosening up your velcro first. My waist is about a 32 and I'm sizing for uh, a medium which fits me really well. As the harness gets wet everything will stretch out slightly. Begin by clipping in the side. Everything is pretty loose here. So grab the straps on both sides, pulling back and then forward, again back and forward. This, a lot of people will just simply try to pull forward but you won't get the harness as tight as they can. So begin by pulling back and forward. Now that these are all snug, you can see that the stabilizing system on the Dekine Fusion and the Sonic is so wide that it really keeps the bar in position. It doesn't want to slide off you at all. The leg straps, you can tension them up. They maintain a nice tension just due to the neoprene that's in here. Don't put them too tight so it doesn't cut off the circulation in your legs and you can't bend real easy. So just leave those there. You can slide the straps down inside, get them out of your way. Once you have the system adjusted to you, it has the clip on this side. Take these straps and put them under the little bungees on each side here and you will usually not adjust these again until later on as it gets wet. These stay in and then you have your adjustment side on the, the buckles. Once these are adjusted some guys just quickly pull these back to just keep them out of your way. 
and that's the Fusion the kind. It has a safety clip on both sides to hook your leash to or you can hook a strap to this around the back if you did want a, uh, a leash, um, leash rope so the leash will slide from side to side. You can see it has a high back point on it. Really good stabilizing. If your lower back starts to hurt, the Fusion and the Sonic is definitely the way to go. So on clipping, slide your straps out, pull back on your buckles. Usually one or two times is enough. Grab the white strap and unbuckle. It's as easy as that. And that is the Dekine Fusion for 2009. One of the top selling harnesses that we have here at kiteboarding.com.